the beautiful story of one god of time well you know that one god of time means all religions belongs to one god of time whether he says that he is of some religion or not that means one god of time owns everything of universe so if one god of time says that he is of some religion then all other his religions belongs to him only so even if someone some genie says of other religions that one god of time is of some religion and if one god of time do mistake or anything then only to which religion he is of he must get they must get punishment and whatever one god of time does because he is of some religion and identifies himself as of some religion but not of all religion through memory in the world of god or words of god so other religion genie says that he is of some religion and he must and his punishment must be given to only some religion which he says and identifies that he is of some religion so are you getting my logic did you understand something until now i mean when all religion belongs to him only when all religions genies belongs to him only so if anything one god of time do mistakes or whatever one god of time does in the world or universe then complete all his religions must do the same and it must happen same to all religions <coughs> so how can other religions how can all other religions which one god of time owns says that or some religion says that you are identified by some religion so you, your punishment and mistakes must be given to only to the religion which you identify yourself as or only to only to religion which i mean if one god of time identifies himself as of some religion so all other religions must even believe in him to be one god of time because all religions belongs to one god of time only so how only punishment will be given to some religion which one god of time believes in or does not believe in i mean to one god of time whom i mean one god of time identifies himself as of some religion so every 
everybody will be believing in wonder of time only. So if wonder of time do mistake or sins or whatever wonder of time does in his reality, like praying or doing something different. Like for example, if wonder of time is doing adultery and identifies himself as of some religion, that's in the world of gods. To give you better un, uh, uh, understanding, one of time will never do adultery, first of all. This is just an example. So if one of time does adultery, by identifying himself as of some religion, will only the religion be doing adultery which he identifies himself as of some religion or all religions which he owns will they be doing the same thing like adultery or not or will they be saving themselves by remembering memory to some religion by saying he belongs to some religion and you must be doing adultery so does all religions belong believes in one god of time or not if all religions other than some religion they do not believe in one god of time so, what punishment must be given to them? Are they of God or not? And the worlds of God whoever lives in the world of God, genies, they act on memories. They t I mean, by act, I mean they take decision on memories which they come to know from reality of universe, like from humans, through their memories. So how only some religion will believe in one God of time and some religion will get punishment. When other religion which belongs to one God of time and you know that who owns all religion He is the God of all religions. So all are servants of, all religions are servants of God and everyone must believe in God only. And if any religion says, We know what is truth about worlds of God and God or one God of time. Then will they be in time in future who never believed in one God of time? Because all religions according to law of God, original God, everybody will be believing in one God of time only who, uh, who owns all religions because they are by, abide by the laws. They are binded by the laws. And if they don't ex 
accept the truth then they will not be in time they will not be in future time because they, they did not believe in God who owns them even if God says he has given freedom to some genies but not all religions or even if God says he has given freedom to all his genies and says he has not given freedom to all religions don't you believe all religions are binded by law of God and until someone remembers them through memory the truth they don't take action so what is one god of time according to you of what all religion genies are actually who runs the religion by the command of belief of one god of time who servant they are I want to know really like will one god of time be punished even if he do adultery or sins because for one god of time there is no sense of punishment even if he sins or do mistakes then his sins and mistakes will become as blessing for everyone because all religions belongs to him so is that just a memory problem to the religions genies or all religions genies who are servants of god one god of time you just imagine the beautiful truth i'm telling you i mean the worlds of god just based on memories of humans or of anyone from the reality of universe and if anyone from worlds of god loses from any one memory of truth of humans or of from anyone then they come immediately and force someone to become bad or force them to do sin or cheat and don't you think or believe that if one god of time i mean if anything happens to one god of time it will completely happen to everyone to all religions genies and uh, uh, they humans and they everyone and if what has happened with one god of time or what one god of time is doing is not happening with everyone to all religions are they believers of god or are they property of god can property go against one god of time because they are binded by law of god see even if one god of time says that he is of some religion and not of other religion then also all religion belongs to him 
mean without the one god of time remembering memory by saying all religions belongs to him then also all religion belongs to him because if you if you compare with humans if human owns a land then complete land belongs to him and nobody can say to the human that the land does not belongs to you or try to own it because the human will do legal whatever he does by owning a land by registering his property in the government so in the worlds of god and all religions the all religions lives by one god of time and law of one god of time god will create a law he does not have to simply tell others that he has listened to a law one what one god of time means one god of time means rulership ruling on all his property which he belongs to i mean which all religions belongs to one god of time so don't you believe it's just a memory game the worlds of god just decides the worlds of god uh, genies in everything as a genie sense just decides or takes decision on memories they come to know from reality of humans or reality of universe or from reality of anyone who lives in reality of universe and what happens when anyone from the worlds of god comes in reality of universe and they are seen and heard to other people how they will try to interact with in i mean how they are, how they take decision in the world of god or worlds of god through memories if they come to know a memory about one god of time and at any time a one god of time can be hijacked or cracked if he believes in anyone and if anyone is not proven by truth that he is one god of time of all religions then that one the genie will not lose or lost from one god of time without knowing memory that he is one god of time so is the worlds of god completely based on memories if one god of time does not tells anything through memory is he one god of time or not those who believes in true love those who believed in one god since the beginning of universe i am asking them if one god of time does not says that he is one god of time and just identify himself as of some religion does all religions belongs to him or not is he still one god of time or not and don't you believe even if 
one god of time says something then also all religions belongs to him in the worlds of god and in reality of universe because everything happens from one god of time only so is it just a memory game with genies are genies of the worlds of god idiots or corrupted or does not have understanding if they don't have understanding of truth how they are controlling the worlds of god how they say their god is true how they say their religion is true how they say their holy books are true it's about truth whether accepted or rejected if you reject you must not be in the worlds of god or in reality of universe you must be punished to death you need to understand me i mean what is world of god what is god actually a god is that who just does not do sins who does not do mistakes who is of purity is that what is your god don't you believe god have understanding god is beautiful god is never wrong even if he is wrong he is true what is your belief actually and don't all religions believe that they believe in their god to be true whom they have seen but according to law of one god of time who is the original god if they fly by saying their god is true do they know who owns their religion their god whom they have seen or the one who owns them so they believe in some god and even fly but did they ever check when flying whom they are believing in how they are flying and anyone can trick any genies of any religions by protect, uh, putting a protection genie inside one god of time or blocking mind of one god of time so don't you believe that worlds of god must have understanding like humans to understand humans and control humans if they don't have understanding how they control the people how they say they are better than humans and everyone one god of time owns all religions and everything of universe so nobody can claim by saying one god of time is of their religion and everything of one god of time belongs to them because in originality everything of universe belongs to one god of time only and all religions belongs to one god of time only So is it just a memory game winning from genies of one god of time uh, like of different religion genies who proves they are true by remembering memories to one god of time servants of genies which belongs to only one god of time is that a game or it's just don't you believe it's only a memory game because according to worlds of god everything belongs to one god of time only so if any religion says when 
वन लॉट ऑफ टाइम गोज इन एनी रिलीजन और आइडेंटिफाइज हिमसेल्फ एज अ वन आई मीन इफ वन लॉट ऑफ टाइम आइडेंटिफाई हिमसेल्फ एज ऑफ सम रिलीजन देन ऑल्सो दैट सम रिलीजन बिलोंग्स टू वन लॉट ऑफ टाइम हाउ कैन सम रिलीजन hijack or crack one god of time after knowing that his religion belongs to one god of time do you believe this these religion must be alive in the worlds of god and in reality of universe who goes against one god of time because every gods or some gods knows those who goes against one god of time in any time they can go against anyone in future and they can do anything to save themselves i am unable to understand if one god of time goes in any religion by saying he is going in any any religion and he is identified of some religion then that some religion cannot claim that one god of time property and all religions belongs to him it's it cannot be happened because according to law of god and according to reality of worlds of god who is one god of time who is original one god of time you tell me who is original one god of time as per the understanding and truth and reality without understanding thinking memory without anything without language and sense and anything who is one god of time so how anyone can change or how anyone can own property i mean how anyone can claim that one god of time belongs to him and rules on the property of one god of time is it acceptable to any religions or any gods don't you believe it's just memory game played from reality of humans or reality of universe and you know that since all religions belongs to one god of time if one god of time he belongs to he is identified as of some religion then nobody can change his command or religion which he says he, be, he is identified as if complete worlds of god acts and takes decision on memories from one god of time then one god of time already might have said that he is identified of some religion so how any religion how any religion god can become like ramses and try to win from one god of time who is originally in a one god of time and all religion belongs to him is it just a memory game playing with genies of the worlds of god in everything as a genie sense if 
any angel or any genie wants to explain me truth, please explain me. I want to know to whom you believed until now. In which God you believed until now. Did you really believe and prayed for one God of time or not? If one God of time tells you to come in front of him as naked, then you have to come in front of him. Is it just that someone will try to win from you through uh, remembering a memory or forcing the one God of time to think or understand something or say something from memory from which you change your mind or change your understanding? See, if everything is from truth, then one God of time is one God of time only. Even after anyone trying to prove through memory to any genies of any religion. In originality, one God of time is one God of time only. And nobody can change it through memories. From reality of humans or reality of universe. But do all gods, if they exist or does not exist, do they really believe that worlds of God is true world of God or just it's a dream of humans or it's, it's just an inside dream of universe where genies of all religion does not have control or knowing memories. And they can be controlled by any memories and they can play with memories and even fool anyone, even try to win from one God of time by cheating with any other religions, genies or anyone through creating a memory of one God of time or from anyone and fooling others by remembering memory, memory of truth. Is that the world of God? Is, is that the world of God? I am only telling it. Tell me. You need to prove me. Whether one God of time is one God of time only or not. Even if someone says that one God of time is of their religion. And they own one God of time and they try to become one God of time. Will one God of time be one God of time only in originality or not? I want to know from the law of God since the beginning of universe, since the beginning of planet, who has created the planet and universe? From all laws of all holy books, I want to know truth, the truth which is beautiful like me. I want to know how much all religions, genies, love their gods or they just believed, how much they believed in their gods or how much they prayed for their gods and who is the god who owns their religion, not just someone who is seen or heard to them and says they are the gods. 